Hoi Pet, a city that lies between the boundary of Cambodia and Thailand. Located in northeast Cambodia, the city teems with people. It is home to many casinos which have lured Thai and Chinese tourists coming into the Cambodian city. Karaoke bars with entertainment workers have also mushroomed, catering to both locals and tourists. Amidst this backdrop, a sex industry has sprouted. 26-year-old Ban Thuan works as an entertainment worker in a karaoke bar in Poi Pet. Ban Thuan used to sell cakes for a living, but she did not earn enough to support herself and her son. She also had to pay for medical treatment for her mother, who is HIV positive, just like her stepfather. Ban Thuan says circumstances forced her to seek a job in the sex industry. I have to face violence from clients. Sometimes they hit me. They throw things at me. The owners of entertainment establishments cannot do anything about it. Sometimes they don't pay me after we have sex. Ban Thuan has become pragmatic about being in the sex industry. She has joined awareness sessions called Smart Girls, where entertainment workers are taught how to practice safe sex. As part of the program, Ban Thuan also undergoes regular checkups at the local clinic. Now I know about sexual health issues. If we are not cautious, we may get HIV. Smart Girls is a program of Family Health International Cambodia. It is funded by development partners, including the Asian Development Bank, which supports HIV prevention and risk mitigation associated with major infrastructure projects in the Greater Mekong subregion. ADB works with FHI Cambodia and its partner women in carrying out the Smart Girls project in Samrong, the capital of Oda Mianchi province. Some NGO like FHI that we have a program like Smart Girl to go inside, they have a peer educator, so provide regularly about the education and knowledge of HIV AIDS. As part of the Smart Girls program, entertainment workers are taught to envision what they want to be in three to five years' time. Creating a future apart from the world they live in right now encourages these smart girls to move beyond the sex industry. When we talk about a smart girl like this, they feel uh, they are very really more than, they are really cute, they, they are really lovely and they work too hard to, to um, feel what the smart girl means. Because smart girl, it means very clever and very beautiful for them. Ban Thuan is clear on what she wants. She wants to become a dressmaker one day and build a home for her mother. But for now, she's focused on keeping her dignity and her health intact, despite the risks associated with her profession. Thank you.